Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, I finally have uh, gotten one of my knives that I've been waiting to get for quite a while. Uh, it finally fell into my hands. The time was right and I was able to get it. Uh, and it's not this one, although this is like it. Uh, this is a 47 style Stockman from Case. Uh, I love the large Stockman, but I think for the medium uh, Stockmans, these are definitely one of my favorites. You get that nice uh, clip blade, kind of reminiscent of the uh, large Stockman, and you get a really uh, decent sheep's foot blade. And this one, as you can see, is in carbon steel. Uh, and I guess this is probably one of my favorite spay blades that you get I, I just love this stubby fat little uh little blade it's just so so capable and i just love the belly on it it's just what a fantastic design of a knife and i like these because they really have a touch with uh history uh because this is part of the knives that case introduced uh prior to 1915 and so it's been around for a long time. It's proven it's, uh, it's salt, you know, it's, 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 uh, definitely one of those knife designs that if it wasn't successful, they, they would not be making them anymore. But uh, I found out, you know, a few years ago that, uh, Tractor Supply had, uh, an exclusive case knife, an exclusive, uh, 47 pattern Stockman and I finally was able to acquire one. And here it is. I mean, this is just a lovely knife. This is an olive green peach seed jig bone. Uh, that is, I think, just absolutely beautiful on both sides. I absolutely love the peach seed jig. Uh, they use it in a lot of stuff, but the olive green uh, color uh, is something you don't see as much. You know, there's, there's a few of them out there, but not a whole lot. And here is that exclusive uh, shield. So it is a little uh, barn that says case on the roof. And you see the XX on the uh, two upper, the upper set of doors there. Uh, so just a, a really very cool shield and not something you see very often. You still have the same uh, clip blade. Of course, this is in the uh, stainless steel, the True Sharp. But, uh, you know, you're looking at the, the same thing where you have a uh, clip point that's uh, 2.87 inches. Your sheep's foot, which is riding in just at two and a quarter inches. I got a little schmutz on there. And then you have your spay, which is right at one and a half inches. But uh, still got that great stubby spay pattern that I... The, that I just love this thing. You're looking at three and seven eighths inches closed. So it's a, it's kind of, you know, probably as big as you'd want in your pocket since it's over that three and a half bordering on four inches, but still uh, really a decent uh, carry. You have nickel silver bolsters, brass liners, uh, and that jig bone that they have on there is awesome. This is that three spring design that the 47 has. Uh, which is really very awesome. Each blade has its very own spring. Uh, you see there's minimal gapping on the uh, back and you're looking at uh, not too bad uh, fit inside the uh, frame. But just look at that. What a, what a handsome little knife. I love a good stockman. <laughs> I think you guys do too. You know, so whether you get one that's a, that's a worker bee in the yellow yellow Delrin, or if you like one that's got the uh, bone covers better, uh, you know, I mean, these are just good, good knives. They're good to pick up. They're good to carry. Uh, really give you a sense of history when you carry something like this, at least for me, it does. And that's a big part of carrying the uh, slip joint knives uh, because you just can't get past the, the history of them. They're just, they're beautiful and, uh, and a really awesome, awesome thing. All right, guys. Well, that's it for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Check out your local tractor supply. Oh, uh, uh, 
As far as the uh, cost, they are a little bit on the high side. Uh, they're not high for a case knife. I mean, they, they run about 85 bucks, but uh, I did catch them when Tractor Supply has sales on all their stuff. Uh, go ahead and pick one up on sale because actually when the, uh, the sale percentage and stuff was uh, all applied, I ended up getting the knife uh, for less than what it was listed for, even including you know, uh, shipping and all that other stuff. And you have free shipping uh, if you pick it up at the store. Uh, you just have them ship it to the store and just pick it up there if you have one local to you, and that'll save you some money as well. All right, guys, well, that's it for this one. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it, because I, I love these knives. I definitely got to get more. I got 47s on the brain. All right, guys, I'll talk to you in the next one.